everybody. Today, I am going to go see my friend at Harajuku. Everything looks so different here in the day that I feel very lost. I'm not exactly sure where to go. Um, stores are opening. Um, I, okay, I think that bike rack looks a little familiar, but this is pretty much my view right now. I only recognize how it looks like at the night. You know, I have a feeling I totally went the wrong way. This feels so good in the morning. Having a nice morning walk. I think everybody else is also gonna go to Harajuku, uh, so I'll most likely bump into them. So, so that's gonna be a lot of fun. I think I found a shortcut. Hey, that's pretty cool. vlogging now so say hi to all my viewers hi <laughs> okay so what is on our agenda today so we can go down the Takeshita street okay and we can go shopping yay there's a kawaii monster cafe <gasps> down is, yeah that place is already crowded should I so you have oh, okay. <laughs> so we have to wait in line last time I went there we had to wait two hours Really? Yeah, it's really okay. popular. Okay. Have all the cute dessert. Okay, I'm down. <laughs> I'm so down. All right, which way are we going? First? Oh, okay. Let's go to the um, the famous street. Okay, that you must see. If you guys don't know, Kathy and I we go back all the way in college. We uh, were in animation together, and she moved out of Japan to teach English for a year. Yep. <laughs> Yay! So now she's gonna take me everywhere. <laughs> Where are we? Takashita Street. Takashita Street? Mm -hmm. Okay. What is the street famous for? Um, it's like hipster style. Like they have all kind of fashion. Oh, look at this! Like Lolita, cute and everything. Wow. Usually it's more crowded. Today is less crowded compared. I heard. I heard Sundays. I heard Sundays are the best days to go. Yep. A lot of people are all dressed up. Yep. Right. You can't even walk here. Usually, it's really? like people bump into people. I'm kind of glad I'm going here now. Wow! And there's a lot of different uh, sort of crepes and boba. This, uh, I can say that this is um, one of the only location you can get boba in Japan. Boba uh, is not popular uh, somehow. So thanks to the homie Bui, I recommended Kathy to get this right here. And then today I just wanted this because I wanted more ice cream and chips. A dessert that you didn't really expect. <gasps> what is that? This one? Yeah. Creme brulee uh, crepes. This is good. Oh. I recommend this one. Okay. I got Doing it last time. So right now, um, I just bought the Gold's Gym and I'm gonna go ahead and walk in and ask if uh, tattoos are allowed because I remember Bart needs a gym to work out. So, we are on a mission. Maybe. Yeah. So this is in the dungeon area. Yeah, oh, man. I should pull up Google Translate and ask and just figure out how to say if we cover up, is that okay? Here we go. Gold's Gym. I'm sorry, Bart. They only allow tattoos 15 by 15 centimeters wide and long. I don't know when you can find a gym that allows tattoos. I'm so sorry. So, Kathy, where are we now? <laughs> I really wanted a hot drink, so I just got the soy cafe latte, I think. I think that's what I ordered. I'm not too sure. So, Kathy was telling me about 
glasses here being really cheap and I really want to get a new pair of glasses because my glasses keep falling down, they keep slipping. So I need to get new ones and I think these might tailor to my face better. Who knows? But I'm excited. I can't wait. And then we're probably going to go to a shrine and then we're going to eat some okonomiyaki that we're going to make ourselves. I'm really excited. It's good. Yeah. Want to try it? Oh, that's really good. I want to see if I can add some sugar in this. I think I'm going to go and check out the glasses mm -hmm. and then wait for them and then go to the temple. Mm -hmm. yes. The temple. Hell yeah. I'm getting some glasses now because this is pretty awesome. Do you want to do the eye test today? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Please. Okay. My eyes are so bad that it's going to take 10 days for them to make it, especially with the lens that I want. So I'm going to get that shipped by Candy Friends. <laughs> now we're going to go ahead and go to what? The shrine? The shrine. Love visiting shrines and temples because it's always so relaxing. Mm -hmm. I was in a mood here. I got yeah. hiking every weekend. What are these? Uh, sake. Ah. Yeah, the barrel for sake. Oh, just like on this side. This is pretty neat. There's a wedding and unfortunately my picture cannot get any clearer than this. All right then. This is a pretty big shrine. Mm -hmm. Holy moly. Have you have you made a wish on one of those things yet? <laughs> Not yet. No. If you guys don't know what I'm pointing at, I'm pointing at these uh, blocks of wood where you write your wish and you hang it up there. And then that's supposed to be a wish for the gods and the way that they hear your wish is that um, the priests is it I think priests or priestess? I'm not sure. I'm assuming it's the priest. They gather all the blocks and then they just burn it and then the wishes will come up. Really? Yeah. They burn it? Yeah, they burn them after a while. I mean, you can only hold so much. What do you want to do next? Um, do you want to check out the good luck charm? The like, one is for hell, one is for dry safe. That's variety. Sure. Sorry guys, I couldn't show you my praying because they specifically had a sign that said no video on you. Yes. So I'm gonna try the omikuchi. Got the English. No. Chicken to something come up. Japanese. I don't know if I did it right. So number 20. I got number 20. Oh, okay. That's 20. I just told them that? Yes. Okay, so it says that this is a poem that's composed in the traditional 31 syllable form by either the Emperor Meiji or the Empress Shoken. Uh, it is hoped that the poem's message will have a particular meaning to you. So, mine says, if we all but recall that we may go astray, we shall be most careful in every trifling act. It is very easy to make mistakes in all areas of life, so never allow yourself to be hasty or careless, but instead weigh carefully your smallest acts and words. Cool! I like this. The traffic. Okay, these are traffic. This is for couples. The golden ones are for good health, for mind and body. So those are for job hunting. Kathy tells me that there is this sake ice cream. Mm -hmm. Okay, the sake ice cream 
uh, that's pretty good here, so we're gonna go ahead and try it out in this area right here. So, we need to buy our ice cream. This, this is the one that we gotta get. Time to bust out. Thank you. It doesn't taste vanilla to me. I'm gonna try it. Whoa. It's good, right? Mmm. It's like a buttery. Mm hmm. It's like a buttery texture. When you can barely taste the second. And then you got apple? Mm hmm. Oh, that's really mm -hmm. good. And they have some like, uh, <gasps> yep, uh, apple the fruit. Mmm. -hmm. That was really good. I didn't think I might want one later. <laughs> This is why I love Japan. Ice cream, all year round. Different flavor, just different location have different type of flavor of like ice cream. I wish they had more apple flavors in America. It was a fun hangout. Thanks for spending some time with me. Thank you, my love. You so much. <laughs> Friends in Japan and friend from America. Uh huh. Okay, so just finished the first sake ice cream, which is really good. Um, not that much alcohol. Like, was it was it point zero nine? Yeah, zero point nine. Yeah. Oh, zero point nine. Ah. That's not so bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like less than 1%. I can handle, I can handle. <laughs> if you guys know me, I really like apple flavored things and I just had to get myself an apple flavored ice cream. <laughs> so good. Now we're on our way to get some okonomiyaki, which you make by yourself, which is awesome because the first time when we went and had the izakaya earlier in the week, they actually made it for us and they just had it heated up on the pan in front of us. But this time, I'm really excited because then you know, um, that one Japanese drama, um, ha ha Hana Kimi Tachini? Ha eh? No. Uh, Hana. Yori. Yeah. No, no. Hana Kimi. Ha oh, Hana Kimi? Yeah, Hana Kimi. Oh. Ha Hana Kimi something something. Mm -hmm. Eh. Whatever it was. <laughs> if you guys know what it is, please comment down below. It's like basically a chick that goes to an all guy school because she wants this one guy to start jumping yeah. again in track and field because well if you guys see it you guys know because I don't want to spoil <laughs> the reasons as to why she decided to sneak into a boys school <laughs> but yeah and I would always see them um, make okonomiyaki uh -huh. like where they had the bowl and they mixed it and they yeah. put it on the grill so like I'm really excited because that's what I really wanted to do here in Japan and thank you Kathy for blessing me no, with that <laughs> alright let's go Finally here at the Okonomiyaki place, my grill. This place is pretty cool. <laughs> the instruction how to make Colombia. Oh, I'm so ready. Let's do this. Look at all of these. There's so much. But you know what? I think I'm gonna go with the number one sakurayaki that has pork, squid, shrimp, leek, mushroom, pork, and egg. <gasps> So we're gonna get the octopus mayo and the buttered mushrooms as our appetizers. We are back on what street again? What is it called? Takashita Street. Takashita Street and uh, Joanna is actually gonna meet us up around 30 minutes. Hey everybody, it's Joanne! Hi! Okay, so if you guys don't know, Joanne is also another college friend of mine that I've known as well, and she's also teaching English out here in Japan. All right. <laughs> so right now we're all on the mission to go and take pictures. <laughs> Let's do this. Here's um, wakashi. This is a Japanese sweet. So eh? Hopefully you can try it. What is what is wakashi? Manju. <gasps> I love. Oh my goodness! Oh, you love manju. This is from Kanju. Kanju? Yeah, Kanju. Is, is that where you're staying at right now? No, I'm not. This is actually, um, oh no. Like, Kanju. Yeah, hopefully you like it. Oh my god, this is forever. Cosplay one. Really? Yeah. Oh, 
Really? Yeah. You have to find it. Okay, so found one, picked one. As you guys know. Now we gotta put a lot of stuff in this luggage space. Oh, it's so fancy. Oh my god. There's like so many lights. So many. It's so nice. This is not a luggage. Totally different. Totally different. Okay. Holy moly. Okay, now what kind of backgrounds do you want? So many. Girl spicy mix? Spicy mix? <laughs> okay. Okay. You want it? Sure. Now we have to start. What kind of, what kind of like, um, like, this is like filter. Huh? Oh, too <clears throat> Oh, the eyes. The eyes? Holy moly. What is this? What's the difference? Uh, like I thought it would change. Oh, right there. Where? I can't even see anything. Oh, it's like a little. Huh? I usually shoot a normal. Okay. What the hell? Okay, Kathy, you do one, you do one. Go, go. Give me another one. Wait, wait, hold on. Dude, this looks so funny. Hold on. Oh my god. Guys, this is how it looks with blue hair. That looks oh, pretty awesome. Cool. I didn't, I didn't expect so much all of a sudden. Because I was like, it's time. Well, I'm just one of the doing. And then it's not like, tick, 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 counting now. I was like, oh my god. Here are the pictures. Good job, team. We hustled so hard. We hustled so hard. I'll try my best. Joanne is doing the honors of cutting I'll try the my photos best. for us. These pictures, they're ridiculous. <laughs> I mean, look how big my eyes are. But you know what the cool thing is? I got blue hair. <laughs> so I'm excited for that. Second round, guys. Okay, so here's how the second photo booth looks like. You know, this actually has a lot more space, I think. Here we go. Oh, look. Editing time. So these are our pictures. Again. Again. I like these a lot better. What do you guys think? I yep. think, yes. I think these are way better. Do you have to pass the key to go? Julia, your mom. Julia. I just got some drinks Here's for everybody. Okay, so I got the Christmas special crepe, and it has a little gingerbread, those custard. I think there's ice cream and mixed berries in. It's just sweet enough, <laughs> and the texture is really, really smooth. So sadly, Kathy has to leave us now, and it's only what? What time is it? Like 6:30? Seven. Seven? Seven. Oh, you spent two more hours with us than you, than you wanted. Yeah. Um, but yeah, now Kathy has to go. Yeah. It was really good seeing you. No. Same here. Come back soon, okay? Okay. Okay. Wanna find a job and a settle down? I mean, find another job. Another job. Yeah. yeah. And hopefully, find a job around Tokyo. Let's go hiking together. Oh, right? we should. Yes. We should. Yes. Look at you guys pining together. Oh, Nakano. Nakano? Snowboarding! Let's go together. <laughs> Bye! <Okay. laughs> so, Kathy just left us, and now me and Joanne are gonna go shopping together. Okay, so I am at Ichiran Ramen with Joanne. Apparently, so yesterday I hung out with uh, Gina for a bit because we were gonna go ahead and tap out, but we decided to stay at like this massage parlor place, and we totally missed out on really good ramen. But today I actually get to try it with Joanne. Yeah, I'm so excited. I heard really good things about this place. Like it's the best ramen place in Japan. Yes. I'm so excited. The menu is solely on like ramen. 
I wonder what kind of broth it is. Broth? It's soy sauce. Oh, okay. It's soy sauce. Broth? Yeah. You can buy the noodles. Oh, they sell noodles. It's outside. Like, oh. When you come in, you get you see this booth. Like you have, we all have individual booths. Yeah. Cool. This is the setup. All right. You put just the, the ramen. Yeah. The machine. Yeah. There's only two options. <laughs> <laughs> there's only two options. I know, huh? There's All right. the regular, and then there's the refill one. Yeah. And then popping. Cool. cool thing is that we're in this little cubicle thing. Cubicle, yeah, cubicle. I'm excited. So here's my ramen. Got my chashu. Got a little bit of spice. Put my egg in there. Look at those shells here. Some green onions. The flavor is so good. Oh my god, you guys would have to try this here. Okay, so I just bit into the egg and it's super delicious. And the pork is so tender. I wonder why in America our ramen, at least the egg part, is boiled completely when I wish that it was raw like this because I feel like this is where most of the flavor comes from. Just finished eating probably one of the best ramens I've ever had in my life. Now I think it's about time that we go ahead and go home. Maybe I might stop by the station where it has a really good massage place. Maybe get a massage. I don't know, my shoulders do kind of hurt a little. But thank you, Joanne, for showing me around. It's really good to see you. Hopefully I'll see you tomorrow. Hopefully. Okay. If that's okay. Yeah, that's fine. And then when you come back, then I have to take you to this beef noodle place that's super bomb. Bye. here and it makes me wonder if the train is still going <laughs> like there's nobody I should walk faster <sighs> okay so I'm finally back at the station that I need to be in and as soon as I landed here I quickly ran over to the massage place because my shoulders are hurting and so tomorrow, I will be getting a massage at 10 a.m. Hell yeah. Now I'm listening to some music. And I'm on my way home. Today was a fun day. I'm glad I got to see both of my friends, one whom I haven't seen in two years, and the other one who I haven't seen in a year. Um, they're actually both teaching English out here. Um, I believe that they will be coming home soon. Not too sure. But yeah. It was really good seeing them. Thanks guys for spending the day with me and showing me around. Much appreciated. <laughs> you guys know how to get around Japan more than I do.